I'm sorry, Laura Allen. Had to sacrifice you to save uh, Stalker. That was a long time ago, actually. I haven't played this game in a few days, but we're ready to jump back in with it. Last mission I had, I was extremely reckless. Stalker almost died. She was wounded. And now she's out for three weeks, which is like a week after the Council report. That's not good. I'm stuck with Black Widow, Bull, and Holly Thomas, and then a bunch of newbies. So I think we're just going to jump right in and scan for activity here. Oh, tried to stop it before the new soldiers arrived. I failed. There they are. Let's see. I don't, I don't even remember how many I ordered. Oh, just one. Great. Only one. He's an assault. Assaults are good. I like assaults. Let's see how he is. Okay. Not that great. Plus one will, minus three aim. Mahmoud Rahman. Okay. Now the excavation's gonna finish in like two seconds. Timed that one right. Okay. Now we've gotten a slot. Okay, I don't even remember how much uh, foundries cost. 75 bucks. Can we afford it to just sell stuff and get a foundry? Because we, we need it that bad. I mean, it's it's kind of vital right now. Okay, I think this is what I'm selling. I'm hesitant to sell these flight computers because we haven't researched them yet. But I need 75. I need 75 bucks, like, right now. So. Let's just hope we can keep the people in those cities calm. The last thing we need is outright chaos. Do I want to build it here or here? I don't know if there's any difference. If it makes a difference, I think I'm going to build it here, though. And that's all of my power, so now I need a, a thermal generator if I want to build more structures. But I need this foundry. Six days till that's done. So, four days till the satellite uplink is done That's the, and research is complete. That's the next thing that happens. Another one of these. We've lost some research time. Honestly, that doesn't seem that bad. It seems that's like the best thing that could have happened uh, as far as things that Exalt can do to screw me over. Because I'm in no hurry as far as research. I have so many scientists compared to everything else. Money, soldiers, engineers, uh, and countries. Not to, Let's not forget countries. Let's not forget that Japan has uh, openly betrayed us. Yeah, I don't think that... I really need to respond to this one that much. Alright. I think I'm just going to keep scanning. Complete. And there's the uplink. That's surprising, actually. I'm, I'm surprised we haven't encountered a mission yet. We've got one week to the council report. Maybe seven days will just pass without incident. Who knows? Okay, this first satellite is going to go up tomorrow, I believe. I might just want to launch it. Commander, our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Question is where? The thing is, barring Exalt panic attacks, I don't think there's anything that's going to make these countries panic that I won't have forewarning about. So I'm not sure if I want to launch this satellite straight away, and rather I'll just launch it with, my rest, with the rest of my satellites later on. Just have to make sure not to forget... Those, those arrive in four days, and the council reports in six. So, believe it or not, the foundry's almost done. We might be able to buy shiv units before the end of the month. Two days. It might happen. Hmm. A tempting proposition. Normally, I would not sell weapon fragments. The way I play this game, I hoard weapon fragments. I never sell them. That's a lot of money. I don't have to make a decision yet. If we don't have a mission at the end of this month, then uh, you know I'll just wait for the council report. I might not even need the money. Who am I kidding? I'll need the money. But you know, no no reason to rush things. Foundry's done in one day. And there she is. Okay. First time in the foundry? 
It's not the prettiest, but some of our more interesting projects will certainly benefit from the adjustments made down here. Oh, great. Okay, I gotta take this money. Weapon fragments be damned. Thanks, Egypt. We're gonna buy lots of robots for you. I gotta start this immediately. Seven days still. It's still not gonna be done for a while. I'll send word to the what? I, I need to look at some of these things. Okay. This is for mech suits and shiv units. I might want this. Hmm. Okay, this is also for mech soldiers. This, I think this this one, shaped armor, is exclusively. Oh, it might be shiv units. I don't know. It's kind of ambiguous. Sentinel drone. Ooh, neato. Tactical rigging. What the hell? Second item into battle? That used to be a support specific ability and it was only for majors. Jesus. Okay, foundry was a good investment. I was gonna I was nervous that maybe I was gonna wish I had built the mech soldier lab, but no, I'm I'm glad I built this foundry. There's nothing else okay, so I'm researching the heavy we weapons platform. That's clearly what I need the most. I'm going. Uh, actually, you know what? I should have hired a soldier earlier, even despite my reliance on shiv units now. I should probably not stop hiring soldiers. It might seem like a waste of money, but like I don't have a, a good team at this point. Mahmoud doesn't really change anything, and uh, I, ne I do need the soldiers. And another thing to mention is that, uh, if you've thought of this already, rapid recovery, uh, it doesn't apply to soldiers who have already been wounded. If I really wish I had purchased that before the last mission I, I did, but there was no way I could have really anticipated my squad site sniper getting wounded for three weeks. So, that's a thing to get, but honestly, I'm in no hurry to get it because I'm going to be really relying on shiv units very soon here. Uh, I, I'm... Guess there's got to be another mission at the end of this month. There's got to be another mission coming. Four days to the council report, though. There might not be. Okay. Panic. Of course. Can't do anything about these. I've already explained why. We just don't have the resources to be sending people on covert ops. Next thing that happens is research getting done, despite the efforts, the half-ass efforts of Exalt. So much for that. Well, this is gonna, hopefully, this is gonna be an easy one. It's a small UFO. Don't need to buy anything. Certainly not. We've got laser cannons, phoenix cannons, we're good. Contact detected. In fact, I, I could probably send the one with the Phoenix Cannon and still still be okay, but I'm going to send Raven 1. Enemy is padlocked. Oh look, I have an aim uplink. Approach Didn't even know it. Now. All right. Like we've got a UFO near the Baja Peninsula, maybe around Arizona, New Mexico. This is actually the kind of mission we want for a half-assed team. Okay, so the question here is, do I take my third assault, Mahmoud, or do I take a second heavy? And keep in mind, I lost, uh, I lost that uh, Laura on the last mission. None of my heavies are good. I have three other heavies back at base. The reason I was willing to lose her is because I know about my heavy situation. I've got three of them here. None of them are good. Uh, one of them, I've actually got two sisters, apparently. Judy Cook and Kelly Cook. Uh, they look like sisters? Ah, eh, no, they don't, but, you know, still. I haven't used either of them on missions, so they're, they're kind of irrelevant. I think I'm going to just go with Mahmoud. This is a small UFO. 
I feel like firepower in terms of uh, just sheer damage is going to be more important than uh, than rockets, which is all we're going to rely on heavies for. Okay, now I have to buy a uh, a scatter laser for Mahmoud. I can't send him into battle without it. I've now got three scatter lasers, which is kind of uh, absurd, but, you know, you might need them for some missions. Okay. Do I want another laser pistol? Because actually the person who most needs a laser pistol does not have one. I think I, last mission, I think I forgot to send her into battle with a laser pistol. I guess I'll buy one of those, since this is surely the last uh, mission of the month. Wait a second. Four laser pistols, I should have enough. Holy crap, I didn't check. Okay, we're good. I think this is just what we're leaving it at. Out of necessity. This is, this is the best we're gonna get. Let's launch them. What the hell? That's a big red barn. A remote area outside a small town. If we can secure the crash site, we should be able to prevent any civilian casualties. That's a big red barn. I want to take a look at this level. Oh man, look at this. Loud and clear, Big Sky. What the hell? Enter those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. This is new. This is very new. I thought this was going to be another easy, small UFO mission. Okay, so this is actually a pretty big level. It goes a long way for this direction, and it goes a long way in this direction. Uh, this level actually seems enormous to me. I'm gonna move full up. Solid copy. It's actually been a really long time since I played this game. I, I'm kind of, kind of out of practice with tactics. You guys? Oh yeah, Black Widow's Russian. Forgot about that. I don't want to even look in this window. What? What if there's something in here? What if there's like a mechdoid in here? I don't want to alert him. Roger, tracking. Heading to that location. Aye, aye, Commander. I'll have launch. This melt is so close I might actually be able to get it, but I, I don't know. There's got to be something in that barn. You don't just put a big red barn in the middle of the level and then not put any enemies in it. I feel, Commander. gonna move her up with the rest. She doesn't really have cover there, I know, but... Gotta have everyone together. Alright, what did I hear just now? I heard floaters. Floaters aren't that bad. I'm okay with floaters. Oh, maybe I can hide... Uh, yeah, this, this is exactly what I want to do, I think. Storm... Storm the gates. Hey, there's nothing in here. Wow. I don't think there's anything in here. Come on, it, Commander. Affirmative. Я пошла. I am really not used to doing a mission without Stalker. Making me uncomfortable. Out. So much for meld uh, being worthless. This this meld is just too easy. I think we're gonna grab this one just because it's right there. Okay. 
Alright, dealt with. It, it did say the meld was this direction. Yeah, I'm willing to let that meld go. I don't think I'm going to rush this mission at all. Let's just get everyone in the barn. Take this slow, make this place a castle. Rolling. Heading out. Switch weapons. Okay. Could they be right here? We would have seen them if they were right here. I still want to open this door just to be sure. Affirmative. Will do. Position confirmed. As easy as these small UFO crashes usually are, I've got a very weak team, so taking no chances. I feel, Commander. Got so many scatter lasers. Not used to having this many scatter lasers. Yep, we're we're moving right past the meld. All right, clear over here. But honestly, I think I want to just keep moving sound? in this general direction. Maybe I should I should open this door though. I should open this door. There's no real reason why I shouldn't, right? I don't know. I ah, just open it. All right, clear over here. This is scaring me because I'm I'm starting to think I'm gonna run into all the enemies at once. Rolling. There's the new assault. On the move. And Holly Thomas, an, an assault I never thought I was gonna use. Bull, however. Heading out. He's a prodigy. Wilco. She's got squad sight. If I could, I would want to get her to elevation. I want her on like the roof. Oh, here we go. I should I should have her just back here and put her on the roof of the barn and just have her watch over everybody. That's the way to use Black Widow. Now I did something like that last mission. Last mission I tried to get Stalker to kind of pull us through the whole mission and she wound up getting shot by a cyber disc. It didn't go well. Hopefully Black Widow will have better luck. The prize. Heading there now. We got the move Zuzana, another soldier I thought I would never ever use. All I'm hearing is floaters. Solutions. Probably just gonna move her that far this turn. But I want her up on this barn. I think that's what it's there for. I wish Stalker was here. She would love this shit. Okay. That's affirmative. Heading out. On the move. Might be a little risky. Nope, no enemies. I think I'll just move up one of the assaults just because On my way. this six man overwatch is getting tiring even for me. Oh man, and just think of the range she's going to get on that battle scanner from up there. my eyes on. Huh? Affirmative. Moving out. I 
can't believe the melt hasn't expired yet. Sound? Still no. Still, the melt is still up. Oh man, I, I've had visibility of it this whole time. Nonetheless, I wouldn't go for that melt. It, it, it just, you know, we would have to move like directly for it. It, it's, it looks close, but I'm sure these enemies are going to be concentrated in the UFO. Alright. I think right here should do it. What you guys? That should give her pretty much maximum visibility. Should I use a scanner now, or should I wait till they get to a slightly better position? I don't know. gonna wait on it. Ah, I shouldn't have just put her on overwatch like that. What am I thinking? I haven't even moved my other guys. Heading out. Not even sure where I'm moving this turn. Doesn't seem like okay. I want to do anything. On the move. Moving up a little bit. I'll just leave him here or something. There we go. Okay. I think this turn is going to be a battle scanner. It doesn't go that far. I thought it'd go a lot farther. Hmm. Kind of a trick shot there. Didn't know you could do trick shots with a battle scanner. But I think usually you want it to be at the same elevation as the enemies, which at this point should be ground level. I'm going to just throw it here. Scanner включен. Scanner включен. Okay, what is up with this mission? We've located an enemy, but it's an outsider. Where are the floaters? I think the solution now, I mean, the door to the UFO is over here. We want to approach the UFO from the door. We don't want to get visibility of the Outsider from this area. I don't think he's going to be very difficult. Outsiders aren't that difficult late this late in the game, but I think we still want to go through the door. Moving. Don't want to move up too much. Aye, aye. But I should keep in mind that I have three running guns to rescue me from harrowing situations. Solid copy. Roger that. And I do think I'm going to just leave Black Widow up on that roof to cover us. I think that's a good spot. Until the floaters come into play and suddenly they're at her level. <sighs> I need to get quicker about these overwatches. This is taking too long. And there's the melt. No big loss. Got it. Enemies in sight. All right, okay, Seekers, exactly who I wanted to meet, exactly who I was hoping I would run into. You know, I'm not, I'm not even going to use cover right here, I think I'm just going to rely on overwatches if floaters stumble into us, and uh, I'm going to move closer to him so that we are virtually immune. Did I just dash? Oh, no, I didn't dash. Okay, that's okay. That's affirmative. And I think Overwatch from the Sniper should still trigger when Seekers are when Seekers appear. Not sure about that. I don't even know if it's supposed to. Don't know if that's working as intended. Right. I've got my eyes on. I guess I'll just put her on Overwatch. And hopefully this is enough Overwatch that Seekers can't do much. Now, uh, you know, I, I moved everyone out of cover. I should remember that they can shoot. Okay, that'll do. I do need to remember that Seekers do have a ranged attack. Yep, here we go. I only get one more overwatch, and that's not going to do it. Missed. 
Lucky. Yeah, I've seen that actually hit somebody and it barely did any damage whatsoever. I think her Overwatch did trigger. I think it was a miss. I'm not sure though. I didn't actually see it. Good to go. Well, I guess that's good enough. All right. Full with the kill. I wish action camera would trigger occasionally when they were going to miss, just so it wouldn't be such a spoiler. I don't like knowing when they're going to hit before they shoot. Got it covered. But it looks so cool. On the move. So I can't turn it off. Okay. Uh, should I reload here with anybody? Probably with just the heavy. Heavy got to be able to shoot. Let's do this. And I'm just going to stay here. I think I, I, I didn't even consider moving my other guys up. Oops. But uh, just go on Overwatch. Make sure we survive this turn. Maybe I should move her over here to the corner. It seems like she would have a little bit better visibility of everything. What are you doing? Eh, I'm gonna reload with her. Not with him, though. Alright, well, they, they've got to be closer to the UFO rather than farther away. I, I doubt there's any enemies in this area, because we're almost to the end of the level. I really like this map. This is like one of my new favorite maps right here. So I'll move Scotty up. Just seems to go on and on. Headed there now. Moving. Roger that. I think she's safe moving up the left. Because uh, you know, she's got this door blocking us. If that door were to open, that would mean trouble. But I don't think it will. Headed there now. I guess the new danger I'm afraid of is cyber discs. I really got rocked by a cyber disc last mission due to lack of heat ammo. Watch. Aye, aye. I really should just take this guy out, but I'm afraid of getting flanked. Uh, in the UFO. I'm afraid of, like, encountering a whole bunch of enemies in there. Roger that. Got it. Heading to that location. On the move. Moving to position. Look sharp. Enemies rolling up. Are you serious? What the hell? They're moving to flank me. This is kind of bullshit. I'm just going to say this. This door is definitely closed, and I am now flanked by a target who's going to shoot through it. I think that... Oh, well, look at that. Well, look at that. Comeuppance. This is clearly a bug caused by the battle scanner. Uh, we alerted this guy. I don't even know how to explain it, but we have, we we like uh, we alerted this guy because we battle scanned him earlier. He was on our scopes, and now the game is assuming that we're on his scopes, even though we've got this door here blocking the way. I don't think it's relevant because of this. Go Black Widow. She caused the bug. She can deal with it. Got it covered. I feel, Commander. I feel, Commander. Not taking any chances this turn. Not after that. Now who's going to be left? More floaters? More floaters. Jeez. Is this an easy mission or what? Now, they might still very well be inside the UFO. I guess I should just do that. Do the standard breach and clear. 
Aye, aye, Commander. I mean, I don't know. It's like now the rules are kind of unclear because, like, would they see me through the door if, if they were in there? I don't think they would because I think it's a, it's a bug with the battle scanner. Heading to that location. All bets are off. Welcome. On the move. Oh man! What the hell was that? Oh man! They are behind us. So I guess I can just open this door now. I think I, I think there's no real risk or harm here. Don't even need to wait for people to stack up the door. Heading there now. Copy that. Alright. It, it, it's now seeming like a liability or a risk to leave Black Widow up here. But I don't know. Her, you can't get better Overwatch than from up here. Maybe she should... Oh, scanner. Obviously. That's what I should do. That's the spot. We got nothing. They must be farther forward. Or farther back. Or whatever you want to call it. Heading to that location. That's affirmative. Heading out. I feel commander. I on that. Scanner is on the prize. <laughs> I want him to just stumble into us and light him up with Overwatch. Heading to that location. Okay. I think that's safe. Oh no, it wasn't safe. All right, one of them is immediately on Overwatch. She's got a shot. She should take it. 98%. She's got to take that, right? I mean, this other guy's on Overwatch. We're not even going to want to move this turn. She might as well just take this shot. Man, this, this is Black Widow's mission right here. For once, Stalker doesn't steal all the thunder. Maybe... Sh oh, I think this would be safe for Zuzana to move up to here, because he didn't... Well... Uh, I'm gonna move her to here, just to be a little safer. I'm rolling. On Overwatch. I'm on. This is just way too easy of a mission. Roger. But I'm still taking it very, very seriously. I never stop, stop taking it seriously. And here's our friend. Daily shoots and misses. Thomas shoots and misses. Those are pistols, though. What about the heavy? Ah, oh, damn it. Oh my god. I'll get him next time. Well, he, he moved to a position where he was flanked. So he had to use all of his movement just to get to a cover a position of cover. But unfortunately now he has uh, full cover. Uh, what are we gonna do here? We could oh grenades. You know, I I'm so used to other tactics that really I've forgotten to use grenades and stuff. I don't think she would be close enough right here, but maybe. That's affirmative. And I guess I'm kind of risking alerting somebody. Okay, grenade, right here. This is it. This is the answer. Throwing grenade. I only need to land one hit, even if it's pistol. So I think I should just kind of. You know, move, well, actually, that didn't help him at all. He, he has just the same shot there. 
All right, let's get the kill for Bull. Oh, Bull, Bull's gonna level up anyway. We should get the kill for someone else. Scotty. Why doesn't Scotty have a shot? Why doesn't Scotty have a shotty? Aye, aye, Commander. Here we go. And I can literally use his dinky little non-laser pistol. All mission objectives complete. Are you serious? Oh man, I feel silly now. I took that mission so seriously. Five enemies. Two seekers, two floaters, and an outsider. That was like the easiest mission of all time. Impressive work, Commander. Our soldiers have to be I don't hear that often. Like that. I haven't heard that in a long time. They always congratulate you when you when you come back with no wounded and no killed. Have they improved flushing shot at all? <laughs> I'm just curious because it seems like it was completely useless before. I know they've improved close and personal, and it's actually kind of insane. Uh, it's really good. But I always take rapid fire. I need, yeah, this is actually a huge upgrade right now. Having a rapid fire assault is really going to change the game. Last time Blitz got up to Lieutenant, but then I lost him on his first mission. That was unfortunate. <laughs> I think I have a medal that I haven't awarded anybody. I, oh my god. Oh my god. I have so many medals I haven't awarded to anybody. I didn't even realize this. Well, alright. This this episode has gone on for a while, so... Uh, and it hasn't been that eventful, really. Uh, sorry about that, but... I can't predict which missions are going to be really, really difficult or really, really easy. And so I take them all very seriously. So thanks for watching, guys, and uh, see you next time.